countdown to Girl Scout cookies is on. Mike Brookbank takes us around town for some unusual cookie recipes. Orders for Girl Scout cookies in Northeast Ohio are coming in fast and furious. Number one is definitely the Thin Mint. About 25% of sales are Thin Mints. In our region alone, nearly 3 million boxes of Girl Scout cookies will be sold. Many are eaten as is, others turned into delicious desserts. Initially, I was actually going to go with a donut. But Embassy Suites sous chef Crystal Lung ended up going with the cream puff. I'll use the Girl Scout Dolce Leche cookie. I incorporate that into the cream puff batter. The Samoa cookie, another favorite, is in the Bavarian cream filling. And to top this tasty treat off... Chocolate ganache with rum added to it, caramel, and more toasted coconut to make it represent the appearance of the Samoa cookie. Cookie deliveries will begin next month with cookie booths opening up in March. I posted Crystal's cream puff recipe to my Facebook page, so get on it. Holy cow. That is... <laughs> <laughs> Cleveland's growing craft beer scene is going to the dogs, just in time for Super Bowl Sunday. The dogs just absolutely love it. Mary Zatello, owner of Oliver and Henry's Dog Shop in Westlake, carries Bowser beer. You get it in two flavors, chicken and beef. You pour it over your dog's food and it makes gravy. It is actually really good for them. It's got the um, barley, which is loaded with vitamin B, which is excellent for the dogs. Um, of course, it doesn't have alcohol. Of course, you can't drink beer without snacks. And from pretzel bites to Brown's bones, it's all here. If the Browns were ever in the playoffs, I wouldn't be able to keep it in stock. So, as you're planning your Super Bowl party, don't forget your dog. For The List, I'm Mike Brookbank.